Okay, for the second video, I wanted to show uh, how to use the remote. And before I get into that, let me just, a uh, couple of things I forgot in the first video. This uh, controller, you have some uh, double-sided tape that you can use with it. It allows you to stick it to the bottom of the counter or anywhere else you might want to. And the LED strip itself has double-sided tape that's pretty strong. So that will give you enough grip for a lot of applications. Now this is the remote. This is the on. And this is the off. This here is the uh, color touch strip. You go ahead and slide your finger around there and it will change to the color that's appropriate. These buttons down here do different things. This one here adjusts the brightness. This one here adjusts the speed. And this one here lets you choose one of about 25 patterns. There's quite a few. So this is one of the patterns in there. And it, if you just keep pressing the same button, you'll cycle forward. Or this button here, you'll cycle back. And it'll go through all the patterns. Once you can find a pattern you like, you can adjust it somewhat by pressing these other buttons here. Just adjust the brightness so you can have the same pattern. But now it's just a lot less bright. You can also adjust the speed. Same pattern. Just hit this a few times. It'll slow it down. Same pattern, just slower. And once you're done with patterns, the easiest way to get out of it is to just touch the the ring and it'll bring you back to just a single color state. You can adjust the, the brightness there as well. Uh, this remote is a, is a strong remote. It should work up to about 30, maybe even 50 feet. Um, and it should also go through about one wall. Um, it uses two AA side batteries, sized batteries, AAA, I'm sorry, that are not provided. And I'm using rechargeables that you can use any battery you like. And that's it. Thank you.